Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we're going to be going pop hunting. Now today I'm kind of looking for the new Garbage Pail Kids ones, as well as maybe the new Hulk bursting out of the Hulk Buster. I think that'd be really cool to find. But we are going today. It is super windy out. We literally witnessed a bird get hit by a truck. Mom, you saw it better than I did. Yes, it was what, gross. Yeah, what type of bird was it, do you think? We think it was a, possibly a turkey vulture, if that's yeah. such a thing. And then we also saw a turkey vulture got hit by a truck. And, and was the, dead on the side of the road. It was kind of gross. And then we also saw... Bird a, smoothie. We also saw one of those big, Sign. like almost like sail signs or whatever, fly, fly across the street and it was like stuck on the front and of the car. A wooden sign. Yeah, I know. Oh, you know, like sign. those ones that are on like the side of the road that show the like highway. the road maps mm -hmm. and stuff, like the highway. It was over, over, and it's like one of those big thick wood ones and too. The car was, we think, it hit a car. It, it, there was a lot. There's a lot of stuff everywhere. Pylons were all over. It's completely tornado. windy tornado. today. Maybe a mini tornado. I, pop putting in a mini tornado. Oh. Pop, clickbait. Anyways, guys, let's get started. Hey. Okay guys, so it's really windy out, but we just left the post office and now we're going over to Walgreens. Sorry if you can't hear me at all. Maybe I'll voice it over. I don't know. Let's go. Okay guys, so down here we see Unmasked Gwenpool and they've got Moana and Pua. They also have Praetorian Guard, which is pretty cool. Um, then they also have this one over here, which is the Million Dollar Man uh, Teddy Biasi with IRS. Um, other than that, uh, this little section seems to never change, but let's go see if we can find the other section where they might have newer stuff. Up here, guys, they have the young Anakin Skywalker and Supreme Leader Snoke. Oh, as well as Clone Commander Cody. Nice. All right, everyone, we're in the eye of the storm at Barnes Noble. I hope you can hear me. It's kind of windy. Sorry. Let's go. Okay, guys, so they have them at the front today. They've got Underminer, Screenslaver, I've never seen in person, Frozone, Elastigirl, Jack Jack, Mr. Incredible, Dash, Screenslaver, Frozone, Jack Jack, Dash, Frozone, Jack Jack, Jack Jack. Let's keep going. Okay guys, so I'm looking around over here. They just restocked everything it looks like because everything's new. And I found an original Dustin Pop. And I don't see these ever, so I might pick it up today. Also, they do have some pop protectors, so I might get a couple of those as well for some of my pops. Um, I am seeing some good ones. Oh, Peasant Bell, that's a different one. Tender Heart Bear is one that I wanted as well. Um, I'm looking around still. I'm, it seems like they restocked, so I want, ooh. That one's cool. It, but it seems like they restocked a bit, so I want to see if I can get some good ones. If they have any, maybe a chase or something, I don't know. But I do want to get this one because I don't have it yet. Um, but what else have they got? The Lothosaurus, there seems to be a bunch of them. So I'm gonna look around in between these. Peppermint Patty, um, I don't know. I'm gonna take a look through all of them and I'll see if I find anything cool. But um, yeah, guys, let's keep looking. I found, guys, they have a bunch of the Princess Leia on the speeder as well as Ocelot and um, the new Winnie the Pooh flocked Dorb, and then the Wrinkle in Time 3-pack, the full case of Incredibles ones, this is the Dustin that I had. Um, a bunch over here, not too much that I want, but uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, they have Ghostbusters Will down there. What do they got over here? Jumanji, Harry Potter, some of the new ones, the Rick and Morty one, ooh, that's really dinged up. But over here, Dilophosaurus again. That's about it, guys, let's keep looking. Okay, so I'm in the 50% off section, and I noticed that they have a Goku Black in here. I don't know if it's really 50% off, but it would be good if it was. Okay guys, so I thought he was worth like 40 bucks, I swear he was, but he's only worth like 15, so I'll be able to get him some other time. Plus, somebody will probably want him more than I do, than just for the price. So I'm gonna put, be putting this guy back. Let's put him, boom, right there. If anybody wants a Dustin, check your uh, local Barnes & Noble. And I was gonna get a pop stack, but then realized I can just get it at home. And plus, I'd rather wait for some other exclusive that I actually really want, or something that I can't get at home, like a Target exclusive. Well, you know, in Canada anyway, like a Target exclusive or a Barnes & Noble exclusive. I didn't see any good Barnes & Noble ones, but anyways, guys, uh, let's go on to the next store and see what else we can find. Okay, guys, it might be windy, but we're at GameStop. Let's go. Okay, guys, so looking around over here, we do see a couple cool ones. This one's one that I've been seeing a lot today. Now, have you seen this one before? Look at them. I like the way they did the mask on the front of it. Anyway, um, they do have, no, I see some Overwatch ones back here. Uh, Z Zarya. Zarya's back there. Pretty cool. Uh, they do have Boris back there as well. Um, around here, guys, though, we do see Gwenum, which is a really cool one. Uh, which you don't see too often. I want to see if they have a Chase um, Violet, because I am seeing a lot of Violets back here, but I'm guessing they don't, just because it's, you know, one of those ones that you're probably not going to get a Chase for. But they do have a lot of them. Screen Slaver's another one. Uh, Boa, never seen that one from One Piece. Um, let's keep looking, though. I do, ooh, it's cool, Bendy. 
uh, down here they've got like their eight dollar section. Not too cheap, but they are cheaper. Um, but other than that, I'm not seeing too much that I really want. So let's keep looking around. Okay, guys. So I found this movie moment, and I want to show you the price on this thing. It's actually really good. Look at this, guys. Do you see that right there? $14.99. Of course I'm going to get this for $14.99. Um, but other than that, over here, just kind of $5 pops. No, Metallica here, $8.98. Pretty cheap. Uh, but over there, DJ's cheaper. But anyways, guys, let's keep looking around. Guys, we just got out of the GameStop. I don't know if you can hear me. I got the movie moment. It was $16 overall. Now we're going over to Old Navy because my mom's there. No, where are you? There you are. It's so windy out, guys. My hair's all messy. More than normal. He's but anyway, exaggerating. Anyways, guys. Let's go over to Old Navy. You probably won't see us in there. I don't know why I'm telling you. I think you maybe see us in Best Buy or Target next. Let's go. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Target. Okay. Let's go. Okay, guys. We're coming up on the section. We're seeing what they got. Um, ooh, Elton John is one. They have Hades. Probably nothing. Hercules. No chase, of course. What do they got over there? Black Panther. Um, honestly? Noah, do you see anything good? Not really. Um, we will ch Oh, they've, they've got 8-Bit Will. Nice. Of course, no Chase version, because why would they? But um, I guess we'll get Will today. Do they have any other 8-Bit ones? Oh, ooh, 8-Bit Mike. Nice. There we go. There's two more to the 8-Bit collection. I don't have these two. I mean, the Chase would be nice, but they don't have it, of course. So, actually, let me push this back. I see if there's anything here. This is a smaller one than normal, too. Look at that. Ugh. Ooh, nope, nothing back there. No, we push that one back. No, let's see if there's anything behind it. What is that? Nothing? Nothing. But we did find these two. Sweet. Let's keep going. I did find Iron Man, but guess what, guys? There's a sale on Thanos, but there's no Thanos. Of course, of course they do the sale after. Come on. Guys, someone told me this on Instagram, and I know it's kind of a dad thing, but I think I'm going to get it. Look at it. A hey, top up. Yeah, we're getting this. Maybe it's $17. I don't know. Someone showed me this on Instagram, so I feel like I have to get it. Okay, guys, so we're on our way to a Best Buy right now. Pretty excited about this. They might have something good. Last time we were in here, we found a Chase um, Tuxedo Cat. Uh, anyways. Last time we were in here. It was, yeah. No way. It was about a month ago. Anyways, guys, let's go inside, see what they've got. Even the Best Buy stuff is it's wobbly. Do you guys see that? It's all b b wobbly. I don't know. It's weird. Anyways, guys, let's go. Okay guys, so we see Carl, which is from uh, Despicable Me. We've got Captain John Price, Foxy the Pirate, Chica, a couple of them, not too many over here. This is a Best Buy exclusive, but let's keep going. Not that much over here. And some mystery minis, brick heads, I mean, that's about it, let's go. Okay guys, so over in the uh, Minecraft section, they have the Ocelots, no chases I checked, Skeleton, which is okay, but then I've never seen this one before. It's the Alex in diamond armor, which is a bit of a weird one. You know, Alex is newer, they threw in some diamond armor. It is the exclusive to here, never seen it before, but still, cool to see it. Probably not gonna pick it up today, but anyways, let's keep going. Okay guys, so over here we found Black Panther, just the normal one, and then they have a bunch of the teenage Groots. Not bad, anyways, let's keep going. Okay guys, so over here they've got uh, the two packs, um, Foxy the Pirate, Evan, and they do have Cuphead, I checked the Chase's Mugman as well, but let's keep going. Oh, the Team Fortress 2 ones, you guys wanted me to look at these ones, here's the Heavy from Team Fortress 2, probably not going to get them, but they are only 10 bucks, anyways, let's keep looking around. Well, because we didn't see anything that we really wanted over at Best Buy. They did have a couple okay things. I'm trying to cover the mic up here, but um, I hope it's not too windy. Anyways, we're going over to Target now, and um, we're going to go back there. I've got the two 8-bit um, pops that I'm going to be getting, so I hope you guys enjoyed those. But anyways, guys, let's keep going. What? Two hours? Two hours to do this? Okay, guys, we're at 7-Eleven, seeing if they have the new Deadpool pops. Let's go. Guys, I don't see anything. I honestly wish I did, but I don't. I've been trying to post this up on a few beers here. Um, there we go, guys. I wish they had something, but I don't see anything. Ah, uh, that's good again. Okay, they don't have anything. I wish they did. I'm looking around a bit. They have a small kind of toy-ish section, but I don't see anything, so I guess we're gonna keep going. This is probably the title of the video and you guys might be sad about it. I don't know if it is or not. I'm working on it, but um, I don't know. Let's keep going guys. They're probably not going to have anything yet just because of how new they are. I don't even know if they're out yet, but I wanted to check because some of the Deadpools are coming out the Funko oh, HQ. Oh, Worth a try anyways. Let's go. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Walmart. Let's go. We're looking for the Rampage 3 pack. Ta-da! Wow. Okay guys, we're going over to the section. Haven't seen anything yet. Let's see what they've got. 
nothing. Pretty much just like usual. Why don't they ever get anything new here? And they got these guys. I guess these are new. Er, is this a Walmart exclusive? No, that's a. Oh, they have one for um, Best Buy. I think we saw that earlier. They do have Black Widow though. That's one I don't see too often. And uh, the three pack up here: Biggs, Wedge, and Porkins. That looks pretty cool. It is Force Friday today, or not Force Friday, May the 4th. May the 4th be with you, so that's cool. Um, but other than that, I don't see too much here. It's kind of annoying. Um, anyways guys, let's look around and see if we can find anything else. Okay guys, so we are now out of Walmart. They didn't have anything really good. I mean, it was eh, not much. It's what we always see. So we are gonna do a quick montage home now. I might forget and you might see a Batman logo. We're gonna try here. Anyways guys, uh, let's go home and then I'll show you what I picked up and then tomorrow you guys will also see the P.O. Box stuff, but we'll talk about that in a bit. Anyways guys, let's keep going. Okay guys, so it is the next day now after we went pop hunting. I know I'm wearing the same shirt, whatever. Um, but I wanna show you guys everything that we got. So the first thing that we got was really cool. I'm gonna show that after because I feel like you guys probably already know what it is. So it's kind of like, what's the point? I'll just show it after though. Um, so the first thing that we got here was, well, second thing, sorry. We went over to Hot Top, or Target, you guys saw that, and they had some pops that I needed for my 8-bit collection. The first one that they had there that um, I saw was the Mike um, from Stranger Things, which is really cool. Now I've got all of the ones on the back here, minus the Chase Demogorgon, but um, other than that, I've got all of them. So that's really awesome. I've been looking for this one for a while now and uh, finally found it. I'm surprised they had it. They only had one of them. They had a bunch of 11s. They always have a bunch of 11s. I'm surprised they didn't make a Chase 11 with Egos, or not with Egos, with Wig. That could have been cool, but they didn't. Um, now the new one that just recently came out, which I had been wanting for a while, is the 8-bit Will. Now, Will is one that I've been looking for. Um, so, well, here's the thing. I wasn't really looking for it. It was more so that I saw it and I, I knew I needed it for my collection. There is a Chase version of Will where he's upside down, but they didn't have that one, of course. Wasatch Pop, as well as, I don't know if I should mention this. He's probably got it up. Jetta Patrol also got this one, too, at the same time. So, pretty cool. Um, I did want this one for my 8-bit collection. Now I've got every 8-bit pop for Stranger Things besides um, the Chase versions. So I do have 8-bit Barb, 11, Lucas. Um, I wish they made a Steve now that I think about it. That would be cool. Anyways, guys, pretty cool that I got all of them. And uh, nice to add to the collection. I'm surprised I got the Will since he just came out. But it, no Chase version, of course. They probably had one at the store. And I saw two guys there, uh, that was funny, that worked there, that were unboxing stuff, and they had it right in front of the pork section. It was a big box. I was like, okay, they're probably gonna have porgs in there. And um, they opened it up, and when they opened it up, they were all sad, and I, I was sad too, because they pulled out a suitcase, and I thought it was three porgs inside of there, because it was the same size as that box, I guess. Um, but anyways, let's get into the last thing that I got here, which was from GameStop, which is pretty crazy. I'm trying to get all of these now that I saw this one. And um, I think it'd be really fun if I could get all of them. I don't know if I will, but we can try. Um, this is the Star Wars movie moment rematch on the Supremacy. So this is really cool because it's Finn and um, Captain Phasma there. I know it's kind of hard to see. You guys can see me in the, uh, well, the, you can see the camera there. See it like right here? Anyways, um, really cool characters. I'm glad that I got this one. It's got Finn with the one, what's FN2199 had that thing in the first one in The Force Awakens, so that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm also excited to see Star Wars uh, Han Solo, a Star Wars story coming out soon, so that'll be fun. Um, but this was one of those ones that I wanted, and it was only $15. I couldn't pass it up. Sometimes this is cheaper. Honestly, $15 is cheaper than I've paid for a normal pop. Because um, at Hot Topic, they're $15.99 in Canada, and this came up to $16. And sometimes in Canada, they have them for $18 if they're flocked and stuff like that. So really cool that I got this one cheaper than a normal pop than I would normally get. But um, I think we're gonna end it there, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this pop hunt. If you guys wanna see more pop hunts from me, we usually try to do one once a week. Usually comes out around Saturday or Sunday. Um, but anyways, guys, this has been another episode of Top Pops. Popsters, thanks for watching. Ah! <laughs> so I'm living my best life. So I'm living my best life. Made a couple M's with my best friends. Turned all my L's in the lessons. You see the whip pulling up, it's like screw.